risk factor for obstructive sleep apnea. If you want to know why this is happening on some people and it's not happening with the rest of the people, there's multiple risk factors contributing to development of sleep apnea. The most important risk factor is probably the obesity. It is known that weight gain will increase the fat tissue around our neck, around our body, and that will cause more obesity. As a result of more obesity, there will be more relaxation of those muscles around our throat and will cause the obstructive sleep apnea. If we gain 10 to 15% of weight, this may contribute to increase four to five times risk to develop obstructive sleep apnea syndrome. Away from the obesity, other factors may be contributing. Anything may cause narrowing back of our throat, large tonsils, in case the jaw is too small, it's being pushed back a little bit, any deformities in upper airway system, all may contributing to some narrowing of our airway. Other lifestyles things may be contributing to this, smoking is known to cause a worsening of obstructive sleep apnea, in addition to alcohol. Alcohol consumption will decrease our brain ability to wake up to get our breath back and will increase the relaxation of those muscles and may contribute negatively on obstructive sleep apnea syndrome. And other factors also contributing is the gender. Male is known to have more sleep apnea than female. And postmenopausal age, which is after age 40 to 50, probably both female and male, they may have equal uh, risk to develop obstructive sleep apnea. So aging, gender, obesity, lifestyles, all may be contributing to obstructive sleep apnea syndrome. Thank you.